All right, kids in Rockland have their neon vests on. Some kids wearing them like dresses. We saw. Them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A little so small, uh, but they're having all kinds of fun. The dirt, water, and all the big machines out there as well. Too. Indeed, Auntie Shade Brown is live, giving us uh, some more of the fun behind the scenes there. Hi, Shade. Auntie Shade, you know, I like the sound of that. Okay, yeah. so now if you guys ever been curious as to the traffic signal, how big it is, well, look, look at this. Check this out. We're going to play a little game. Red light, green light. You see how big it is, guys? This is, I'm like 5'10". This is, this is a pretty big, decent size. But this is just one of many <laughs> machines that is here at the Rockland Meet the Machine event where all the kids are here to learn, explore, and their curious minds just, well, okay, maybe not the water play, but they've been having a blast here, even at the dirt pile, just checking out these machines, all of this for the National Public Works Week. So we're here with Justin to talk a little bit more about the event. So I know it's happening till noon today, correct? Correct. Okay, so what can kids like interact with more? Because I'm just seeing so many machines out here. So part of this is we, uh, our partners in the utilities and the public works industry have come out and they've brought their things. And so we've got South Placer Municipal Ut Utility District, okay. our, our sewer provider, they've come out. We've got Craftco, we've got Dominguez Landscape. We've got uh, Herc Rentals. Um, all of them have partnered with us to make this event possible. And so we've got a little bit of everything um, from the, the loaders and the vector truck to the real mowers uh, for parks to the uh, excavators that they have and uh, the bucket trucks for signal maintenance and light maintenance. So we've got a little bit of everything today. And I would say that this is a perfect event for parents who have little ones and they just want to take a break from their iPad or tablet, right? And just kind of play oh, in some dirt. <laughs> absolutely. Like this, having kids play in the dirt, like <laughs> they just forget about everything else. It's great. And so to have them come out today and have the opportunity to get this hands-on experience, it's wonderful. So we invite everybody to come out today and uh, uh, enjoy celebrating Public Works Week with us. Um, it's it's going to be good. Okay. And how's the turnout? Because I know that, yeah, they've been playing in the dirt. They've been playing in the water. They've been playing basketball, too. But, yeah, they're still kind of curious about the machines. We've had a great turnout today, uh, more than we anticipated. Um, the community has come out, and you can see all the little... Uh, reflective vests and the hard hats that are out there and so wonderful turnout and uh, it's only uh, 10 o'clock so we're hoping to get a lot more people out. It looks like you guys may be expecting more because I did see a couple more uh, parents in their with their strollers and the kids just having a blast right now. So we did have a little one that stole the show and I wonder if he's still out here. He might not be. Okay. He was out here before and he had like a basketball and everything and it was the cutest thing. You can't help but smile and have fun here just looking at the little one. So if you don't have any plans, it is Thursday. It is a Memorial Day weekend. Come out, enjoy your time with your little ones. It's here till noon. Back to you. And they'll so go and they'll have tons of fun yes. and they'll get tired and then they'll yes. take a nap. Auntie Shade. Yes. <laughs> Auntie Shade will watch the kids for about 35 minutes. And after that, you're on your own. Man, 35 <laughs> minutes, it's a nice break. It is. That's a good one.